Honey, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just waiting for the unisom to kick in. <sighs> All right, sweetie. Something is clearly bothering you. It's silly. It's okay. Talk to me. It's the Megalodon. What? I took the kids to the Natural History Museum this morning. Right. And there's this exhibit all about marine dinosaurs, and apparently there was this huge great white shark called the Megalodon. Okay. Well, I'm terrified. Right, but they're extinct now. I know. So there's really no threat. But they were. Just swimming around the ocean waters looking for a me-sized snack. I just don't know what we can do about that right now. There's nothing to do. I know. Just go back to bed. No! <sighs> the Megalodon was the size of a boxcar. 60 feet! A boxcar, Alan? That doesn't bother you? Not really, because again, they're extinct. Well, there's a subreddit. Since when are you on Reddit? Today, Alan, keep up. Diva in Dying 22 said it could still exist deep in the Mariana Trench. Improbable, but not impossible. Scary, right? If they haven't been spotted for literally millennia, I think we're probably good. Well, they could come back. What? Mythbusters 252 posted, Current climate conditions are technically inhospitable, but the planet is warming. Think about it. They could come back. Honey, I think Their this teeth is... are 14 inches long. The size of my arm. How are you so calm? Sweetie, I hear you, but I promise megalodons are not just going to magically reappear in the oceans. You can't promise that. Ugh. I guess you're just the tough guy, huh? Immune to all threats? Going about your daily life with the confidence of a straight white male? Is there something else you want to talk about right no. now? No! I just wish you understood. Well, honey, I have an irrational fear too. Oh, yeah? Like what? Yeah. Like, sometimes I worry that I've left the barbecue grill on after burger nights. Okay. And then I worry that the limiter gets clogged and that the heat caused the metal encasing the tank to expand. And that during the nighttime, a cute little squirrel has wandered in and made himself a nice little nest of pine needles and thistle and cotton. And then the metal that's heated up causes that nest to catch on fire, which in turn unclogs the limiter, leading to a chain reaction where the tank explodes, making a giant Weber grenade turns us all into a meat paste. The white hot shards of metal. Look at screaming hot fireball. Well, that's never going to happen. I know. Yeah, so I'm... stop worrying about it. But I'm just trying to make it... I'm so... not trying to be harsh, but get real. Okay, it's more likely to happen than your extinct shark. Have you felt how hot the grill gets? Uh, you know what? The unit's on kicking. I mean, there could be a squirrel crawling in there right now, building a cute little nest. Good night. Now I can't sleep. <laughs>